Hi everyone, this is Ajamu Jimmy and welcome back to my Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom Let's Play. I hope you're having a great day. Um, over here it's rainy. Um, and we are at Trapanta, which I don't know why we are here. I think we weren't really supposed to be here, but we ended up here and you know, it is what it is. Let's go find a story. So let's jump right into it. We talked to this little girl. Ina, ah, good evening, or no, good day. Yeah, that's what I meant. Well, well, welcome to our stable. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh -huh. Sorry, I'm nervous. You're our first new customer in a while. You're a traveler, aren't you, mister? This stable is so far to the west that we don't get many new customers. Even less now. There's this really bad snowstorm in the Huber region next to us, so nobody's showing up. So, did you come to talk to me because you wanted to ask about the stable? Sure. As I suspected, you just had this look about you that said, I hope someone tells me all about this amazing place. Well, allow me to give you an explanation of Tabantha Bridge Stable. Hi! Okay, so if you want the rest, if you want to rest here, go to the counter inside the stable. Normally, my mom would tell you all about the area around us, but she's under the tree talking to a Rito lady right now, so I'll tell you instead. Ah. If you head west from here, you'll, there's Rito Village. And if you head east, there's New Serene Stable. And if you want to know about the stable's facilities, just ask my big brother, Kenyo. He's working just nearby. <laughs> oh, and also, I'd be happy if you talk to my little brother, Sho, too. I love getting to work with my family. Oh, what a pleasant... What a pleasant little girl. Oh, no, he needs to reach his friend. Oh. Hey buddy, have you seen some white goats around here? Uh, I'd given these, those goats all the love and care in the world, and the other day they ran off the earth. <clears throat> they didn't even finish all their food before they left. The Hylian pine cones weren't eaten. I followed Princess Zelda's recipe perfectly, but could it have been the feed that drove them off? Recipe? Oh. Yeah, Princess Zelda shared a recipe when she visited the stable a while back. It's really amazing how much she knows about animals. I never would have expected her to be developing healthy feed recipes. In this case, it's a recipe for a special kind of feed for white goats. The main ingredient is fresh Hylian pine cones. Mm. It's actually pretty unusual. It requires you to mix the pine cones in whole. You don't grind them down or anything. I didn't want my wonderful white goats to eat the recipe the princess gave me. So I put it in a hole in a glass bottle. I didn't want my wonderful white goats to eat the recipe the princess gave me, so I put it in a glass bottle. Ugh. But a big storm came through one day and blew it, blew the bottle off somewhere. I wasn't able to find it after that, so I've been making the recipe from memory since then. Uh. But that would make my white goats spit up the highly, but what would make my white goats spit up the highly and pine cones and run off just like that? Did they, did they really hate Princess Zelda's recipe that much? Bro probably like made a mistake. Let's see what Pen has to say. Mm. Hmm, hardly a trace of recipe remains. Just the remnant of half eaten Hylian pine cones. Oh. Hey partner, you're looking good. Were you also pulled to this place by the inescapable tug of a story? I'm chasing some new chirps and warblers from my beloved little birds. A group of goats is a herd, or a trip, or a tribe. Anyways. This stable has been raising a small herd of white goats, or it was until all the goats, all the white goats up and vanished all of a sudden. Mm. That's not where it stops though. Some have said the Princess Zelda may also be involved. It looks like you can, uh, it looks like you caught up with the stable hand Chork about what happened. Mm. Chork says the bottle that he kept Princess Zelda's recipe in was blown off somewhere by the wind. As a result, the feed he's been giving to his white goats was made from what he could remember of the recipe. I can't believe that Princess Zelda would teach anyone a nonsense recipe. That doesn't seem like her at all. It's important that we find these white goats. Oh. But I think we should also find the recipe that might shine some light on what exactly Princess Zelda was up to. I'm going to poke around and see if I can turn up any other oh. information. Partner, time for you to get to work. There's a big scoop here. I can feel it. So we're just gonna solve everyone's problems as we report on them, is that it? Oh! Dabby. 
Thanks for coming in such bad weather. Yeah. Hello and welcome to Tabantha Bridge Stable. Oh. Thank you for supporting the Stable Association. Since this is your first time here, we'll add one point to your pony points. Now then, once again, oh. welcome, Link. Do you want to register a horse or take one out for a ride? Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Hebra, okay. Yep, yep. Okay, great. Will the rain ever let up? No. Yeah. Travelers like us have to be wary of rain and wind and rain. If you're not careful, the chill will sap your strength and you won't be able to flee when you need to. In short, don't be reckless or you'll get yourself hurt. Yeah. Whoa, fate brought us together again. Ah. Well, can I tempt you to buy or are you here to sell? You know, what have you got? <laughs> I can't get that now. This is too expensive. I don't need anything. <laughs> what is that? Mm -hmm. Gaggle. Hmm. Is something bothering you, young man? Oh ho. Could it be? Is this bright young fellow interested in the poster too? Reports say this is a rumor is a picture of a beast that's been rumored to be lurking somewhere in Hyrule. Mm. It's been the talk of the stables. They say that Princess Zelda herself has was seen traveling with this beast. Look at those tusks. What a fearsome creature. I wonder where this beast is right now. Quite a mystery, don't you think? <sighs> if I were younger, I'd like I'd hike to all the stables to find out if there's any truth to those rumors. Let's see what the news oh. is. Great fairies flee. Okay, we already heard this. Uh. Uh. What else? Ah. Blood moon. Oh, okay. Hmm. Uh. Mm. Oh. All right. <laughs> Nothing interesting over here. Let's talk to this boy. Ah. Can you? Yo. Um. No. I mean, hello there. Yeah. Welcome to the Bantha Bridge Stable. Uh -huh. You know, we're giving you're giving off kind of a swordsman vibe. Oh, because you are one, I see. Uh -huh. Whoa, a real life swordsman? Erk. Uh -huh. Sorry, I said that too loud. Oh, I mean, uh, I'm sorry. I got a little like, too excited there. Uh -huh. Um, my name is Kenyu. I want to be a swordsman someday, so I'm doing all this work to bulk up. Nice to meet you. I'm gonna be so buff someday that I won't even be need a tow a towing harness to carry lumber and stuff. Wait, towing ah. harness? You didn't know about towing harness? Oh my gosh, no! I, I, bro. Ah. Oh, wait a minute! You already have a towing harness? Ah. Towing? Oh, okay. Bro, you didn't tell me anything. I didn't get to know. All right, then I'll take them. Oh. oh, do you need to speak with Banji? Apologies, we were caught up in our conversation. I'm from the Rito village to the northwest. Uh. Times are tough where I'm from. Merchants aren't able to reach my village because of the bl blizzard. We're fortunate the kind folks from the stable are sharing their supplies with us. <laughs> it's thanks to them that uh, the children have, still have full bellies. Uh. Don't mention it, really. The Rito have been good neighbors to us. We're just returning the favor. You let me know if there's anything else you need, all right? I can arrange to have it sent there and then pack it up for you to carry home. Oh. Words cannot express my gratitude. Yeah, she's literally saving her life. So what, am I supposed to find some place where there's wind? Farming tool used to collect hay efficiently. It's light enough to be used by anyone. Okay. <laughs> oh, eggs. It's 
still no Hetsu man. Where is he? Two dogs. Um, what? I'm above the storm. Can I test out on them? Oh, I actually need weapons. I really don't like this water hammer, and I can make another one anytime, so. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a new one. Ah. for me my ally Goblin horn. Oh my gosh. A large blade like horn with a unique flourish on the tip. It's sharper than it looks. Attach it to a weapon to vastly increase attack power. Hmm. I guess this is like a higher level area. It would be really sad if I go through this whole game without finding Hetsu.
Okay, so I need to eat something. And I also should build a, make a weapon. Um, I'll use this handy dandy pitchfork. What am I going to attach to it? I mean, why not? Why not? I got so many of these. <laughs> Strong fusion. This one does what? Two handed weapon with a decayed blade attaching to it. Greatly enhances the material's power. So I can add something that's pretty powerful. Hmm, what do I want to add? I could add this. I could add this. Uh, I'll add this because I feel like uh, it's not going to be that hard to find the uh, the silver bokoblin. I mean, I've got one right here that I know I can always find it. Oh my gosh. Wait, this thing is jiggly? It's kind of funny looking. Wow, 72. Well, it did say strong fusion. Let me see what this dude... Where is his friend? I just want somebody that will tell me about Hetsu. How hard is that, man? Oh, my friend and I got separated. Bro, all the way over there. Oh, we have to follow the goats. Okay. I see. Oh, we've already got something here. Okay, perfect. Let me see what device I can use.
gonna make it. Anytime, anytime. Reunited and it feels so good. Oh my gosh. Alright, you know what? I need the 20 rupees. be enough honestly. Okay fine, maybe not. Uh, that's not really doing much but I'm done with this man. I hate him. I don't hate him. I just, you know, it's not a fun mini game for me. Ah! I'm gonna go intercept that that person running in the rain. What's your name? Oh, it's this guy. Due to recent attacks on folks who are distracted by dropped objects, be careful paying attention to your surroundings and don't go carelessly poking around suspicious objects. What? What does that even mean?
at it. I wanna find these find these places. I saw the trail. But I kinda wanna pick up those those pine cones. And I saw enemies as well, so we may be in for a little scrap. But nothing I can't handle. Here's the pine cones. How did these goats leave such a perfect trail? Those are my white goats, so this is where they ran off to. The dude was trailing us the whole time. <sighs> there, there. I'm just so glad to see you. Are you all okay? And you're the one who found them? Thank you. I won't forget this. <laughs> this bottle. This is what I was using to keep Princess Zelda's recipe safe. Let me see it. I need to check the recipe. Mm. Yes, yes. Wait. Oh, no. Grind the pine cones into a powder. I'm not supposed to use the Hylian pine cone hole. I should have known something was off. I it did really look hard to me. My poor sweet goats. <laughs> you must have been you run off because of that awful food I was making them eat. I'm so sorry. I hurt you all when I thought I was helping. It was my fault all along. I would have run away too. <laughs> I can't believe I doubted the recipe that Princess Zelda shared with me. I should have noticed my mistake right away. After all, I really do want to take the best possible care of the goats. Bro, you're just... You're beating yourself up over this for nothing. But it's just not right. It's just not about what kind of food you feed them, right? It's important to show them you care with all your heart. Mm. I swear that from now on I will take care of you with all the kindness and compassion that Princess Zelda displays. That's the best way to show my gratitude for her sharing the recipe with me. <laughs> oh, and I really, really can't thank you enough for finding my white goats and the recipe. We're going to head back to the stable. You take care. Hi! Hey, partner. Pen's cheese, I, but there's no story oh. now. How's oh, everything, partner? Ah. A perfect investigation with a happy ending. I'd expect nothing less from you. Hmm, do you think it's a coincidence that the missing white goats and the lost recipe were in the same place? I have another theory. Maybe the white goats set out to find the bottle themselves because they couldn't stand to eat the wrong recipe anymore. I don't think that's the case, but it just, it does make you wonder, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's right. This was your first job, wasn't it? Partner, you did quite well to get such results your first time out. Why, I'm being a little proud of myself. Here's the start of an, uh, to an old egg nest. Whoa! Money! Yeah. As you take on more stories, your base pay will obviously increase and there are bonuses of course keep up the good work all right i'm gonna hurry back to hq and bring word of this story's conclusion to our readers see you later partner i look forward to chasing another big scoop with ah! you so long that's so lame oh a star Whoa, that's not a star, is it? That looks gigantic.
see if we can get there in time. I got no fire anymore. Okay, we can fix that. These Lazalfos um, things are so easy to come by, so I'm not too worried about them. And they're fairly high on the, on the damage scale. I don't think we can get there, but we'll try. <laughs> no, maybe we could. I think we got until 5 a.m. It's so sad. Okay, now there's something else I wanted to test. So, let me see this. Sapphire rod. That's just ice? Yeah, so... Because it's a magical rod, I want to try um, this thing. Actually, no. First, let me try this. No, first, let me try this. <laughs> There's nothing. Then I want to try this. I'm curious to see if it behaves differently. <laughs> So then this is probably not going to be any different, but... Okay, all it does is make it more powerful. It's kind of lame in my opinion, but... It's whatever. to get some lore, it looks like. What the heck? There are all these birds here. What's that? Oh. I remember this. There should be a shrine right here.
Is this the mountain that glows at night? I'm not sure. I think this is on this. Here. Apple Central and I have no weapon for this. I need something with a blade. Axe like it's a horn. I mean, this looks like an axe. The, where's the moving tree? Where's the dancing tree? <laughs> Let's do that again. Let's run that back. That was good. <laughs> oh, maybe I could try this. Dude. Oh my gosh, come on. Apples again after this, I think.
What would make a good axe? I mean, I'll try this one. I think this is about all I'm going to do. I'm just going to cut this all out so you guys probably don't have to watch all of this. It's just a lot of fun getting these apples. That looks very axe-like. You know what, I think I've, I've, I've done enough damage to this ecosystem that we can call it a day here. Man, I really did a number on this ecosystem. <sighs> it's alright. We'll grow back, maybe. We'll see. But anyways, that's it for today, so thanks everyone for watching, and I hope you have a great day. See you in the next part. Bye.